Well, folks, there's no better time uh, to, than summer to introduce your kids to exciting STEAM experiments. It sparks their curiosity and keeps their minds active even when school is out. Here to show us some easy projects using items you can find all over your house is Kosal Chia, the owner of Idea Lab Kids in Ballantyne. Welcome Thanks. back to the program, Kosal. Thanks, Jorge. Good to be here. Great to see you. Look, for anybody that's missed a segment where you've been uh, here, not only can they catch it on WBTV.com uh, slash QC Life, but... Explain to them what you guys are all about there at the Idea Lab in Valentine. Sure. So Idea Lab is a STEAM learning enrichment center. We have five classrooms, visual arts, science, tech, um, engineering, and a culinary arts kitchen. Activate all parts of the kid's brain. Look, summertime, sure, you can relax, you can go to the pool, but you still got to keep that mind going. So what can we do in terms of STEAM experiments with some of the things we have at home? Yeah, we're going to do some engineering projects today. It's not about just the what and the how, but the why and the what ifs, right? Okay. So we're going to start off by making a marble trampoline. Marble trampoline? A marble okay. trampoline. You so got to teach me something because I don't know what that is. <laughs> all you need is a cup, a, a, a balloon, rubber band and a marble. All right, easy enough. And uh, it just bounces off just like Look that. Look at that. Um, it looks simple, but the great thing about STEAM is um, it, it's not just about doing it, but it's about the learning behind it as well. So go ahead and pick a color. Oh, well, blue is my favorite color. All right, the easiest thing to do is grab mm -hmm. your scissors over there. All right, scissors. We're gonna cut here. just the bottom half of the balloon. The you easiest way to cut is I'm gonna fold my balloon in half like so. All right, all right, here we go. And then I'm just gonna cut this bottom half and I'm gonna fold it over my scissors and stretch it to the back of the scissor and that gives it, because balloons are really stretch and elastic, so it's really hard to so cut. So you want the bottom or the top? Actually, you- or did I ruin it? Uh, yeah, you ruined it. Oh, you gotta I pick did. a new one all here. Right, new one. <laughs> Hold on, I missed it. So just the bottom half lengthwise. Oh, the bottom half lengthwise. Yep, so you gotta so fold this So this guy right way. here. Yep. Well, good thing I have a backup in red. Absolutely. All right, here we go. Hold on, hold on. I'm nervous. And it's easier if you fold it in half oh. this way first. Come on. Yep, you got there it. There we go. Yeah, got the, elas it. the elasticity makes it a little challenging. All right, now I got it. Here we go. Now, it's easiest to start from the front of the cup facing you. Okay. Okay, so you just put all of your fingers inside the balloon. All right, we have about 90 just go seconds left. Right over, like so and stretch that over the top. <laughs> <laughs> All right, there we go. All right. <laughs> this is not working for me. All right, here we go. All oh right, boy. and grab a marble. All right. And that marble. just holds the balloon in place. Look at that. And you can challenge kids to see how long they can get that marble they up get, there. Yeah, they can even measure the height. How about this guy? Exactly. Wow. And even better, <laughs> you can even check out angles and see if you can make it into this oh, cup, okay. Jorge. Oh, I played this oh game so off, so no, off. That one. How about this one? Here we go. There we All go. Right, see, that was closer. Power, that power. was closer. All right, we have about 45 seconds left. What else can we oh, do? Oh, let's make one more project. One more project. We will get to the robot, dude. Uh, but we have vibration and sound. So okay. pick another balloon. Okay, Balloons are pink. great to have around the house for all types of STEAM sure. projects. So I'm gonna pick a yellow and all you need is a nut. Okay. So you can compare nuts with washers, different size nut, but put it inside the balloon. Okay, see you later. <laughs> well, okay. Blow it up a little bit. It can be big, ah, it can be small. <laughs> yeah, okay, here we go. <laughs> and uh, what you do is you just spin it and the vibration of the nut creates a cool space-like sound. Let's hear it. What? Hold on a second. Let me see how we're... Give my, that a try. Let me see, hold on. Hold and on a second, hold on a second. That's the scientific mind insane. right there. You're comparing the size of the balloon and the different sounds it makes. That's fantastic. So, yep. Kosal, thank you so much. I want to put your information up on the screen so people know where to find you guys. Idea Lab and Ballantime. Kosal Chia, thank you so much. Make sure you follow them on Instagram. How cool are these, Kristen? Your eyes got as big as a little <laughs> kid's head.